In this video, you're going to learn about Keenbox disease. Do you have pain in your wrist when turning your hand upward? Is your wrist swollen? Is it difficult to grip things? There are many conditions that can cause such symptoms, but one of the lesser known conditions is Kinbox disease, a disease that is usually found in young adults. Kinbox disease is a condition wherein the blood supply to the lunate is blocked or interrupted. The lack of blood flow may cause deterioration to the lunate or may result in death of the bone cells. There are many theories of what causes Keenbox disease, but the exact cause is unknown. Some of the theories suggest that a predisposing factor is a trauma to the wrist. However, in many cases, the disease can be linked to a specific traumatic event. In addition to the difficulty in understanding what causes the disease, it's also very difficult to diagnose as well, mainly because the symptoms are very similar to other common wrist injuries like a wrist sprain. Usually a physician will discuss the symptoms and medical history and use imaging tests like x-rays or MRI scans to diagnose Keenbox disease. Pain in the wrist is one of the most common symptoms and the intensity of the pain will vary. Some of the other symptoms will include a painful and swollen wrist, limited range of motion, stiffness in the affected wrist and hand, weakening grip, swelling and tenderness on top of the hand, and pain or difficulty in turning the hand upward. Keenbox disease has four stages and the treatment is dependent on the patient and the stage of the condition. However, there is no consensus about the ideal treatment plan. There are both non-surgical and surgical treatment options and usually the first recommended treatments involve bracing the wrist and anti-inflammatory medications. If these treatments are not effective, the physician may recommend surgery. Keenbox disease can be very painful and frustrating for the patient due to the lack of consensus around the cause and ideal treatment. However, if you have any of the aforementioned symptoms, the best thing to do is see an expert physician as soon as possible. As the rate of progression varies from patient to patient, it's best to get treatment immediately to help reduce pain and preserve the function of the wrist. Contact an IBJI physician today.